What's up guys? It's Jackie and I am one half of Two Random Girls. Okay, so for this week, since school is sort of coming to an end, I decided to come up with 10 things I hate about school. Although my list can really be miles and miles and miles long, it's so annoying when people are just walking along and they stop right in front of you. Like, really? You're gonna do that? Right here? In the middle of the hallway? All right. I mean, if you're gonna stop in the middle of the hallway, at least don't stop in the middle of the hallway. Go to the side. Do you know what I mean? The second thing I hate about school are teacher's pet. I mean, yeah, you can suck up to the teacher a little bit, you know, be like, you know, try to bump up my grade. If I'm at an 89, try to go to a 90 or whatever, you know. But when you're like literally up their butt all the time, like literally stop. And I've probably literally said like literally 20 times already. Okay, the third thing that's so annoying is when you're walking the hallway and you see a couple just groping each other. Like, okay, yes, you guys are together, we get it. You guys can kiss, whatever. Whatever, that's cute, that's cute. But when you're like, literally, I can see your tongues and I can see your hand go up her shirt or down her pants, you need to stop. This is a school place, this is a public place. If you're gonna be doing that, I don't need to see that in public. Can we agree? Like this, if there are people in your school who do this. I know we're not the only one. I know I'm not the only one. Okay, another thing that I think is really annoying, I mean, is when people dress super duper inappropriately. Like they're wearing high heels, short shorts, I can see their boobs, I can see their midriffs. I mean, yeah, if you're gonna wear heels, whatever, everybody, you can wear heels once in a while, but I mean, personally, I wouldn't wanna wear them because that's like a struggle, walking, my feet are gonna get tired. But I mean, you do you, girl. I mean, if anything, I would wear just like the little booty heels, okay. But when you're wearing full-on stilettos, what is this, a strip club? And also, if you're gonna wear shorts, wear shorts. Don't wear booty shorts. That's not booty shorts, it's underwear. If I can see half of your cheek, it's underwear. I don't know how your mama lets you get out of that door because if you were my kid, you know dang well you wouldn't do that. One of the things that I hate most that I've said about basically everything else is waking up early. I hate waking up early. Luckily for me, I live only like five minutes from my school and so but I have to wake up like at six. My bus comes at 6.50 but come on, I have to wake up at six o'clock in the morning. Literally, on the weekends, I would sleep until like 10. It's not like I wake up in the morning, I'm like, yay, school! No. I'm like, school. And don't you guys hate it when you guys have to wake up, you look at your phone, and you're like, I have to wake up. But then you go back to sleep, and when you go back to sleep, you wake up five minutes before the bus, and we wake up five minutes before the bus. You gotta hurry. You gotta look like crap. And I'm already, I ain't already pretty enough. I look like more crap. This takes me like 30 minutes to get ready and I look decent. You know, you know what I'm saying. Number six. Another thing I despise, despise, don't hate, is weekend homework. Like my teachers will literally wait until it's Friday, 10 minutes before the bell rings, and be like, okay students, on page 583, you'll be doing numbers 10 to 12, 13 to 17, then 20 to 40, all the evens. Really? You don't give me homework all week? And then you wait until the weekend, where I wanna sleep in, relax, Hang out, go to parties. Just kidding, I don't get invited to parties. You are gonna mess up my sleeping schedule by giving me a long page to do for homework on the weekends. Like really, 
You're gonna really gonna do that. Teach yourself no chill. Number seven. Tests. And not only just test, tests that have nothing to do with the things you learned that week. Like you'll be giving me notes and I'll be like, okay, whatever, taking notes, taking notes, go on the test and be like, okay, so here's the one word that you know. Now you should know the definition of that and something that goes along with that that I haven't teached you. Like, does that make sense? Really? You're gonna test me on something I don't know? And then you're gonna blame the whole class and be like, you guys should have studied. You guys should have taken notes. You want us to study and pass the test that we did not have notes for? Number eight. Literally, high school is this. They'll give you a bunch of classes that you won't have to ever use in your future. And then they're gonna make you do it. I'll be in college being able to factor trinomials and doing complex fractions, but I won't be able to do my bills, my taxes, but that's good. I could do complex fractions and all that stuff. All right. Okay. Okay. Number nine. Don't you hate when you're at the end of the term and you're like at an 89, 80, 79, 80, and you're kind of like, please don't give me a test at the end of the year. Don't give me, don't fail me, please. Help me, Lord, help me. Please, teachers out there, if a student is at an 89, just give them that 1%, just 1%. And then God bless you. <laughs> Number 10. I know all of you guys have had this teacher where the bell will ring and then the teacher will be like, the bell doesn't dismiss you, I do. The bell just rang. And then I'll be late to class, and then it's gonna be your fault that I'm late, and then I'm gonna get in trouble with my teacher, and I'll be like, it's my teacher made me late, and all the other students late, and I'm late for your class, so it's not my fault. Like, literally, they'll, the bell will ring, be like, the, the bell doesn't dismiss you, I do. And then 10 seconds later, I'll be like, okay, you're dismissed. Really? You're gonna hold us for 10 seconds after the bell to give us a point of he the bell doesn't dismiss you, I do. Bitch. Okay, so that's my 10 things I hated about school. Well, top 10 things, you know, cause school is annoying, but I need to go cause I'm not trying to work at McDonald's. I, but if you work at McDonald's, yes, I would like a side of french fries with that. Okay, so if for all you guys who do know, me and Ashara, um, we hate each other right now, so that's why we're not doing videos together. I'm just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. Um, right now, me and Ashara have these conflicting um, schedules. I can do things on the weekend. She can't do things on the weekend. I have stuff to do on um, the weekdays, so that's why we're right now we're kind of doing our own thing for now, but on the same page. Okay. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Like this, subscribe. We post videos every Sunday. Next Sunday will be Shara's turn. I'm not sure what she's doing, but um, comment down below if there's anything else you hate about school. And I know you hate something about school. Please um, spread the word about us. I know right now we don't have a lot of subscribers. We're only like 30 something. But for those 30 who are actually subscribing and watching, thanks so much. It really does mean a lot to us. Honestly, when we had like 10 subscribers, we were like, oh my gosh, we had 10, and we got 15, and then we got 20, and then we got 25, and 30. I mean, right now it's really not a lot, but, you know, I don't, we don't expect us to boom overnight. But every one person who watches this, every person who subscribes, it really does mean a lot. I just want to say thanks, and please, once again, subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye!